Thank you. We're going to sing a little song for you. The itsy bitsy spider climbs up the water spout. The acid rain washes the spider out. Comes out the sun and dries out the acid rain. Anyways, let's get into what we're about to get into. We're about to get into a DVD update. Let's get into it. First of all, we got The Walk. From the director of Forrest Gump and Castaway, The Trampolite 2 Story. One, mean, one man's dream inspires a generation. That's what it should say, but it says one man's dream inspires a nation. 2015, Columbia Pictures. This video, this this DVD here came from Family Video. You can see there's the white stuff. I don't know if that plays, but the first store I go to now, their um, their company's policy is now is that if you buy a movie from them and it doesn't work, you have a week to return it. Otherwise, I've been screwed over. I've been screwed over so many times that I've been. Pro I'm probably out like a few hundred dollars. At least. Just kidding. I've only had one that hasn't worked, but I've been out. I've been out money before because I bought. I go in there and buy audio cassettes because they're fifty cents, and half of them that they have in there don't even work. I've gone in there, and bought VHSs, and they don't work. So you don't know. That could be a dud, for all I know. I went in there on Black Friday and I spent probably $2.50 on $5 worth of merchandise. And half the stuff didn't work when I brought it home. It didn't work right. So, this movie's got Alex Baldwin in it, Bill Murray, two very good stars. As you must know about Alex Baldwin, he got in big trouble. Somebody gave him a loaded gun. And he shot and killed somebody. Very horrible. And then also, not in the news now, Elon Musk is trying to take over Twitter. Look what happened when big corporations try to take over companies these days. Doesn't work out very well. From the director of Jerry Maguire and Almost Famous. Comes this new hit movie called Aloha. Try saying that five times fast. Get the Blu-ray for more. If I could afford the Blu-ray, I could get. I, I would. I would get it. I can't afford it. The run on Amazon. It's way too expensive. Prices. That stuff needs to come down really quickly. Streaming services are taking over. People aren't going to put up with those high prices very long, especially VHSs on Amazon. They went ten dollars for a VHS and then three ninety nine shipping. Back then, when I used to buy them, they were. Three or four dollars. It's too damn expensive. I used to just buy them because they were seven or eight dollars. I could get like three or four of them for twenty-five dollar gift cards. So it doesn't really matter these days because everything's going up. So you won't be able to afford that much. This one's kind of hard to get open. There's the Aloha. 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 If you can't do it, I'm more talented than you are. Here's breakfast at Tiffany's. Holy crap, Audrey Hepburn. Wow, that was a really long time ago. That was 62 years ago. Wow, it's been that long. They should redo it. They should redo this movie. And then they should have... Um, I forgot what her name was again. Um, I don't know. They should have some new girl. They should Emma Stone. They should have um, Emma Stone play this part. So, and then they should have like all the new air actors. They should make it like nice and beautiful, like how it used to be. However, this one's a widescreen Paramount one. So, I gotta do. I've gotta um, do another widescreen Paramount DVD collection update or another. 
another another video with all of them in it again. I gotta get like two or three more before I can do that. But however, here here's this movie. So this is a mono pressing 61 mono stereo. Actually, no, they don't do stereo. T well, Lucas um, brought out um, THX in the late 70s for sound, so way much better sound. And this is a 99 press, so probably original part of the series. That's the most beautiful DVD I think I've ever seen. Just the way how it looks and glistens probably outside. But however, that's breakfast at Tiffany's. Here's the last one in the batch that we got today. Sorry about the bag flying all over the place. It's kind of hard to do it when you got one hand. The one-handed bandits. <laughs> That'd be funny, though. <clears throat> you cut off their other hand. It's kind of like Home Alone, the sticky bandits, but you got one-handed. <laughs> Here it is, the two disc special edition DVD of Troy. If I would have paid twelve ninety nine for this, that'd be ridiculous. I wouldn't have money. That'd be a week. It'd be a week without buying anything at all. So here's the back of it. I did pay a dollar ninety nine for it, but today was orange tags. I did not get any of these fifty percent off, so I paid full price. That means I won't be able to buy anything until March, which means no more stuff, newer stuff, or contents until March. We'll see, though. You never know. I might get somebody to get me something cheaper. You never know. It might ever come up on Facebook Marketplace. You might see something cheaper. You never know. But this one's a two thousand four. So, 05, so they were selling these new, or they were selling them used, probably for $12.99 in probably May, let's say March to May, to probably June and July and August, and then probably comes time until early part of, or late part of 2005, early 2006, maybe 07, to, you know, this year they probably would be selling them. Let's say at Blockbuster, they'd probably be like six ninety nine, and then three or four years later, it'd probably be cheaper. Oh, look at that. It came out of there. Let's see if I can get it back in there. Yeah, I was able to. Normally, I'm not. Normally, we just go with another take, but this is actually take five. It took me five attempts to take this video, so... Kind of fascinating information. I never, if I ever make a mistake in these videos, I typically don't release them. So, so that's the first disc. Here's the second disc. The bag wants to fall over on top of everything like it usually does. I usually don't show my bag at the front of videos because it's the bag I carry around. I rarely find anything out in the out on the streets, so. The past, I've seen PlayStation 3 games out on the sides of the streets. Nobody wants them anymore. Because the problem with PlayStation 3s is they only last like 10, 15 years, and then after that, they're done for. The internal, the HDD thing inside of them doesn't work anymore. And that's typically what happens. So, I should do another video. I should do a video on PlayStation 3 games. You guys would find that fascinating. The ones I've just... The ones I've got and the ones I have are pretty amazing. But, however... Anyways, that's this. That's this DVD update. Hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed it, put like this... Use your hands and... And... Get some use out of them by clicking the like and subscribe button down below. And click the bell icon so you don't miss any new videos. As always, thanks for watching and peace out. And anyways, this is February 16th, 2023 DVD update. Cut.